So you have a Mac and you would like to do a remote interview. This is now a lot easier with the latest release of Hindenburg. Hindenburg now comes with its own audio device that will let you route sound from applications like Zoom or Skype directly into Hindenburg. If you're new to Hindenburg, this might not sound like a big deal, but if you have been with us for some time, then you might have encountered Soundflower. But that is no longer needed, and the latest installation of Hindenburg can even remove Soundflower from your computer. So let's try to install Hindenburg. I have opened the download package and just need to follow the steps. Not much to see here before we get to this step, the installation type. Stop here for a second and notice the Customize button. Press that and you see more options. You now have the option to uninstall Soundflower. You can do that if you like, as we no longer need it. The rest of the installation is straightforward. Once installed, we can open Hindenburg. In the input selector, we find a few changes. One is that Soundflower is no longer there, but more interestingly, we find a new device that is called Other Applications. This is the Hindenburg audio device. So how do we use it? Let's try to record a call from Skype. In the audio settings in Skype, we set the output, here called speakers, to Hindenburg. And that's all there is to it, really. Back in Hindenburg, we can record using other applications. If you are recording a Zoom call, FaceTime call, Google call, or anything else call, then it's the same procedure. Set the output in the application you're using to Hindenburg, and in Hindenburg, record from other applications. We do hope that you'll enjoy this new feature.